Hello, hello, hello everybody. Today is 27th day, 27th of January. There is a situation in the world. There is a fear and a panicky situation as a result of an epidemic, scare of an epidemic. There are many places where everything is almost shut down. So the question is, today is, are you, are you scared? Are you of a panicky nature? If yes, then you need to do this exercise for becoming fearless. For becoming fearless. The more fearless you are, stronger is the immunity. The more frightened, the weaker the immunity. Okay. So if we tackle the fear, if we tackle the panic and become fearless, automatically we become, we have a stronger immunity and a stronger immunity helps in preventing almost any infection. Prevent almost any infection. So what we need today is this simple solution to take care of the fear, panic, to become fearless, leading to a stronger immunity and helping prevent almost any infection. What are the positions for this? One is the forehead and second, you have to place it on your heart, one above the other. The hands have to be placed one above the other. These are the two areas where we're going to do it. But we have to start. But we have to start with, let me see if I have to adjust the video so that it comes to the right position. Yes. Now the background is good. I need to do it sometimes. Okay. So now, as usual, we'll go into the center of the head. Mine. Life purpose, state your life purpose. I will state mine, the ageless you. You state yours. If you don't know, just say my life purpose. Desire. What are you desiring towards your life purpose? Decide what you want to do towards your life purpose in the center of the head. Third, do what you need to do for your life purpose. So let's hear the sounds in the center there. Desiring, deciding, doing. You'll feel these words themselves create a vibration with the sound and also it carries the meaning. Next step, we make the following statement. Again, close your eyes. I strengthen, like I empower, enrich, and as eyes. I empower, enrich, energize the earth element, water element, fire element, space, air element, space element and its functions of the head and body. 
continue to experience the vibrations in the head. Experience the peace. Experience the silence. Experience the balance. Experience the stressless state. Now place your hands on the forehead. You can open your eyes if you want to see it. And under the hand, say frontal voluntary functions. Temporal area, audio, sorry, temporal audio functions. Third, parietal, parietal sensory functions. Occipital visual functions. Center back of the head, cerebellum balancing functions. Brainstem regulating functions. Center of the forehead, wisdom functions. Top of the head, pituitary health and fitness. Center of the head, eternity functions of the pineal gland. Now we will work on fearlessness. So place both your hands on the forehead on each side and say on the left side fearlessness and a stronger immunity. On the right side, under the right side fearlessness and a stronger immunity. Fearlessness and a then again repeat it nine times. Left, right. Fearlessness, stronger immunity. 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 We have done it three times on the left and three times on the right. Let us go deeper and continue. Deeper into the head. Fearlessness and stronger immunity. Fearlessness and stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a 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 stronger immunity. Now we have done it six times. Go further deeper and again repeat. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. 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 Now, place your hands on the heart, one above and one below on the heart. Not one, not the hands over each other like this, but like this on the heart. Like this. And then go under the left hand, close your eyes and say, fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Under the right hand, fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Now this you're going to do it the second time, go deeper into the heart. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Go a third step deeper into the heart. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Four. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Five. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Six. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Seven. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Eight. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. The ninth, the deepest step. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Fearlessness for a stronger immunity. Keep your eyes closed. Separate your hands, move your fingers, move your toes, rub your hands, cover your eyes and under the, in the darkness, open, close, open, close, open, close. And the eyes open, separate your hands. Did you feel that warmth going deeper into the heart? 
when you were doing this fearlessness? Did you feel the same, some sort of vibration going deeper into your head? When you were doing it? Can you assess how was your state of fear before and the state of fear afterwards? Are you still scared? Are you still panicky? Are you better? So this is the way you assess. And you need to assess this fearless state and the panic state throughout the day. You, you need to repeat the exercise three times a day. At least you can do more. And as you go, you will notice that you're no more scared and no more panicky. And you start becoming fearless. And automatically your immunity becomes stronger. There are different methods of assessment. Remember, this is the first step towards a stronger immunity to prevent infection. Is managing the scare, fear and panic. So that the immune system automatically starts Instead of becoming weak, it starts becoming strong. It, it may have been strong, but it will become stronger. So, and you need to do this. And I want you to come back to the second day. There are several steps to st strengthen your immunity in order to prevent any sort of infection. Not only this thing. And why doing this and the whole family practicing this automatically is going to work on the whole environment. It's going to affect the whole community, the society, the city, the country. So this was the first step towards a stronger immunity to prevent any infection and to come to a disease-free state. So the 366-day program is about coming into a state of ease, coming into a state of diseaselessness, coming into a state of preventive measures. So that's all for today. Thank you. Looking forward to seeing you again. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to ask and write your experience. Everything what I say is measurable with every type of measurement technique, be, be it non-medical or medical, from the perspective of strength, from the perspective of flexibility, from the perspective of performance, from the perspective of blood tests, Everything is measurable. I want to tell you, even the immune system and immune factors, everything, you will notice a change if you work with this. It will not only prevent, and if you work, you can complement it towards the cure. Thank you. God bless and see you again tomorrow.